Hey guys, how's it going? DUJ2 here, and welcome back to Kingdom Hearts Union Cross. Okay, um, the reason why you guys see me constantly just loading is because uh, some of you might know I was streaming earlier today. I actually had originally planned to stream all the way until reset tonight, uh, but it's not in the cards. My system is still down. It's still messed up. Uh, so right now I am trying to make this video. I don't know how long it's going to take to upload. Hopefully it will upload before midnight uh, and I can release it. And whenever I do an update video, it's going to have to wait until I don't know how long. But let's talk, guys. So um, earlier today, we got this email, this email, this tweet. A beautiful new set of medals are approaching. Hashtag KHRX alongside a celebration. Make sure to keep your eyes glued to our Twitter tonight for more info. And uh, when this was actually earlier this morning, I was talking with DHE uh, because they had something brand new come out. Um, something called... Um, <coughs> stained glass. The stained glass medals. And... As you can see here in the background, there are some. Now, JP only got two. Uh, JP got a reversed magic and a upright <coughs> magic metal. Um, and then, earlier tonight, we got this. We're celebrating 8 million downloads with four very special deals. I thought we had more, down more than that. All starting tonight at midnight. Your first draw from each deal is free. I pause at this moment because many of you out there know that this is something that we have been waiting for <coughs> for a considerable amount of time now. Um, free draws. We are going to get the first draw for free. That means you are going to get 10 medals for free. Now, not only do you get 10 medals for free, look at the banner. We're getting a trait medal for free. Not only if you decide to pull for these medals, which it says that you get them within five draws, not only are you guaranteed to get the actual medal on the fifth draw, but you're also going to collect four, perhaps five trait medals on the way. So you're going to be able to fully trait these medals. Now, what do these medals do? Okay, um, I'm going to talk a little bit. Let's finish the tweet. Um, your first draw from each deal is free. Bonus jewels and SP attack campaigns start tonight. Also, I know, I know. Uh, I, I should have waited to guild some medals, but, you know, I needed them in a the moment. Uh, plus, check the in-game notice for preview on some upcoming... Oh, which actually, uh, for those of you who don't know, I was able to... I almost finished uh, Vexen, the Vexen event. Uh, the setup that I ended up uh, finding, which if my system was working, I could show you guys right now. Um, the system, the, 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 the setup that I ended up using, uh, it actually was enough. It actually was enough. And I was actually able to complete, almost complete Vexen. I didn't complete it. Uh, if I would have had more time for, to let RNG a trigger, uh, I could have finished it. Um, I found a pretty interesting setup. I, you know what? I'm going to have to show it to you guys. You know what? Actually, I could show it to you guys really quick here while we talk a little bit more about this. Um, so... Uh, plus check the in-game notice for a preview on some upcoming content. Hashtag KHRX. Okay, so, um, why am I not showing this up? Um, let me see. Okay, uh, cancel. Come on, it's right there. Um, let me do this. Okay, uh, so let's talk a little bit more about these medals really quick before we actually get into it all the way. So yeah, I do have it on. I don't know what's going on. For some reason, I can't, I can't check this. But anyway, um, actually, you know, let me, let me disconnect from here. Uh, let me see if I can't connect somewhere else here. Okay, um, so I don't know what's going on. What do these medals do? Uh, now, a lot of people have been saying, oh, these are going to be game-changing medals. Uh, let me go ahead and pull up over here something that I have where it talks about the actual medals and what they do. Um, here we go. 
So, um, what do these metals do? Uh, for example, the uh, aqua. Okay, so let's see, aqua. Um, and they're going to just be called uh, uh, stained glass metals. Stained glass metals. So, uh, aqua is attribute uh, upright magic. Gauges cost gauges to tier eight. Multiplier 10.82 to 15.46. And the ability, AOE, buffs, general attack by seven tiers for one turn. Buffs upright attack by seven tiers for one turn. Debuffs the enemy GDD by four tiers for one turn. Debuffs the enemy's magic defense by seven tiers for one turn. Raises the guilt of all metals by 40% for one turn. Damage skills higher when the metal set a higher slot number. Uh, so these are not metals that are designed to come in and replace. Um, they're not. They're not designed to come in and replace uh, the current metals that we already have. Uh, for example, these are not going to be metals that are going to be replacing. Um, what's it called? These are not metals that are going to be replacing. Um, I think I got it. Maybe. Yeah, I did. Uh, so these are not metals that are going to be coming in to replace Kyrie. Okay, they're not going to be metals that are going to replace Kyrie. Uh, they are metals that are going to come in and replace um, the other trio metals. Okay, so these ones are going to be able to take metals to forty percent buff in special attack. Um, and some of you might not understand what that means. Um, we can go over that a little bit later. <sighs> they are different metals, though. Um, these are metals that are going to come and change quite dramatically what we've been we've been doing in the game right now. So <clears throat> let me show you guys the setup that I was using. Um, so I believe it was this one. I think it was this one. The, is this it? Yes, this is the setup that I ended up using. Uh, so I said I ended up using this setup, um, and I did get very far. Um, that armor of Ericus has uh, ground on it. So uh, it did get me very far. It did actually push me extremely far into the event. Uh, and if I would have had a little more time, I probably could have been able to complete Vexen as well. <coughs> so it was awesome. But I got far. Thank you very much to everyone to help who helped me on that. But anyway. Um, do I think these medals are going to be game changing? They are going to radically change a lot of things. For someone like me who ended up to continuously, like, I refused to go for the other trio medals because I was like, it's wonderful, but I already have Aqua. Uh, sorry, I already have uh, Warrior of Light and I have FFRK Terra. I can do a lot with them. I don't have the, the greatest setup because they're not AoE, uh, but I didn't need the other medals. Now, these medals, with this deal, the fact that they also have trait, you get the free, for, free first pull. It's pretty awesome. I'm currently sitting at a little bit over 24,000 jewels. I will be able to pull at least from two of these, but you'd be surprised. I don't think that I'm going to be pulling from all of them. Also, understand that we are seeing magic and power. We're going to be getting power, upright power, reverse power. Sorry, upright magic, reverse magic, um, upright power, and reverse power. Um, for me... I believe that I might go for the power ones. Uh, that's just because of the different setups that I use, i.e. the one you just saw behind me. <sighs> I'm probably going to pull from this, guys. Okay, uh, I'm probably going to pull from this because not only do these metals have the trait metals that come with it, this is something that we haven't seen yet. We haven't seen this kind of a, this kind of a deal before. Uh, which also understand it's very possible that there are going to be more metals like these that are going to be coming soon. Of course, the speed ones. Uh, also, understand, please, guys, that this probably means that we are entering a new phase in the game. We are entering a new state of the game where we will be seeing... Uh, we're going to be seeing metals like this, you know. We're going to be seeing metals that are going to potentially this. Now, please understand, these metals do not replace Kyrie. Uh, Kyrie EX and Xion EX, unless you were to go for the magic ones and use, like, say, Diamond Dust and Counterpoint, if you are going to make single color setups, if you're going to make, sorry, single attribute setups, if you're going to make single attribute setups, yes, you can replace those. But regardless, I still think that I'm, I personally, for me, I'm still going to be running uh, my Kyrie setup. Also, the fact that these metals, the higher you place them in your setup, the more effective you're going to be. So you're going to want to put them in the fourth and fifth slot. <sighs> I might go for Aqua as well. 
I don't know. I don't know, guys. I mean, this is kind of mind blowing. I am very excited to see what happens. I will try and be live at midnight, although I'll tell you right now, the way this looks, it probably won't happen. I will be releasing a video, though. Uh, will I be pulling right away? Perhaps. Perhaps. Um, do I feel bad about the fact that I just ended up spending about 20-something thousand jewels? A little. <laughs> I'm a little salty. I'm a little salty that I ended up using so many jewels in the previous event. Uh, I understand, you know, and I got some good stuff. I'm the only the reason why I'm not super salty about the fact that I just spent a bunch of money or spent of jewels is because I did end up getting him. Ended up getting this uh, armor of Erica's was amazing. Uh, it definitely is going to make a very, very, very large, uh, big difference in my current setup. I believe that my 358. No, he didn't get anything much better. Um, so. Getting him is really going to change things for me. Uh, I'm very happy I got him. <sighs> I can't wait to get more. But anyway, I'm going to leave it there, guys. Please let me know what you guys think. Do you guys think that this is something we're going to be getting? Also, for those of you who don't know, we're getting four. JP got two. Um, yeah. The game's progressing, guys. The game is definitely progressing. Uh, if we see something like this, it means that there's much more coming, guys. Uh, also understand that even though you might be thinking, well, I'm not going to pull from this because something even better might come soon because we just barely got the trio medals. Well, we're kind of neck and neck with JP right now. I think that these medals are going to be, uh, very, very valuable and relevant for at least a few months, guys. Uh, and in that time you can save up. Uh, the only other thing that I can say right now that would be different is if we get some massive damage medals. Or if we get um, a different setup, you know, like a, a new a new Kyrie EX, a new ge truly game changer um, or meta changing metal like that. Um, these these metals are going to definitely alter the meta. They're not game changing. Again, you guys know my definition of a game changing metal. They are wonderful. They are amazing. Um, you know what? What is game changing? What is game changing is the banner. Those banners guarantee trait every single pull you pull five times you're going to get the metal and oh wait yeah you're gonna get the metal metal <coughs> you're gonna get the metal and you're gonna have yourself four chances a trait that is game changing that is a game changing meta sorry a game changing mechanic um of course it still is tied to pulling with jewels to spending money we do are getting a free one though so that's very nice um, but the fact that we are, you know, uh, it, it, it is a mechanic that's still tied to jewels, uh, to be able to pull from all four of these, you're going to need 48,000 jewels. I don't know how many people have 48,000 jewels laying around after what we just went through. And remember, probably next week, there's going to be more. So be very careful how you spend your jewels, guys. Go for the ones that you need. Like I said, for me, that reverse power is definitely wanting to come home with me. Uh, and maybe the magic one, maybe the magic one. Anyway, thank you very much for watching, guys. As always, I am DUJ2. This has been Kingdom Hearts Union Cross. Hopefully, I'll see you guys in the morning or at midnight. Hopefully, if I can get everything fixed, which honestly, guys, right now, it does not look good. I don't know if I'm going to even be able to stream tomorrow. I'm going to try, though. I will be trying. Thank you very much, guys. I hope you guys have a wonderful night. And good luck if you pull. See ya.